one of them, one of them's down. Hello subscribers and welcome to another video from Paraplays and in this video we're still back at Respawn. I've got quite a few little videos to put down or put out from Respawn and today we're going to be looking at one of the objectives. Now straight after lunch one of the objectives were to take three areas and in each area there were two flags, blue team and red team. All you had to do was knock down the other team's flag and leave your flag standing which means you then control that area and if you captured all three of these flags or all three of these areas then you actually got 50 points now we weren't too sure originally where one of the flags were you kind of have to find them near these wooden crates and as we were coming back out of respawn we'd all gone back in well three of us had gone back in for uh, re-ammo myself and dean and steve as we were coming back out we noticed two yellows had just come out of their respawn over to the left so we were joking to them to run by run and we were going to shoot them but we didn't you know it's fair play you know in war should we say so we let those guys go and then we work our way directly forward in as we came out of the respawn we can actually see two of the flags and what this video really does emphasize is is that initially i rushed in i didn't look properly and over to the left there was three or four guys on the ridge laying down you could just see the heads and with camo on you've really got to look right and with the light starting to drop really quite effective so that's one thing and also not only for me to learn but also for them to learn as well because once they actually got the kill and me and steve were down in the ravine with the bandage up waiting for a medic when we went back to respawn, the, the change, the respawn was just behind us, their old respawn, they didn't move. So when I was coming back, I knew exactly where they were and I took all three of them out. So if you're going to get the kill or you're spotted, don't stay in the same place. Move position, make it difficult for the enemy or op for to know where you are and then you can basically ambush them you know if you think of it that way so be sneaky beaky out there don't stay in the same place and i'll comment a little bit further as we get into this video but let's try and get down into this little ravine where the boxes and the flags are and see if me and steve can get down there and put blue's flag up are we all doing seven i thought it was four no you've got we're not holding that one there's seven in it you've got all three at once oh where's the map yeah, you're going to have to hold it down. There we go. Guys, get Yeah, three, five, and seven. Yeah, you've got to so hold you you the flag up. <laughs> Shit, we're off already. <laughs> Steve, there's two enemies on that side already. Other side at Ridge. We've got to physically hold that flag up in the air. It's too slippy to go down there. You can't go down there. Right, Steve, I'm going to go grab that flag. Jesus. Oh, fuck. Hit! Hit! up there on that ridge where I'm pointing over there just for my viewers and those are the flags there that we have to grab so these guys are obviously on defence and that's a good position actually that's where we were last time waste of time stood here going to take your medics out well not necessarily because somebody could come down that ridge and grab you Medic! Oh, 
I bet they've all gone up to Top Ridge. We don't know which, which one's our respawn anyway. Oh, they're coming. And I can see pillars. Stop shooting me, my arm's up. As you can see, there's the enemy there. Three of them. <laughs> They're communicating with each other. In fact, there's four of them down there. Five of them. This um, Shimag is actually stopping my goggles steaming up. Yeah, it's stopping air going up, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah. And there's a yellow ear working his way up, and the bottom there, slipping in the mud, is looking at me. He's very cautious. <laughs> so, we got in yellows, we've got one going left, one going right, one in the middle, and there's two on the ridge who've just moved. And we've also got somebody up left there, where I'm pointing. So they're pretty much all the way around here now. Actually, this is quite interesting. These two guys are actually shooting each other and they're both yellow. So... <laughs> There's two yellow shooting at each other here. You shooting at a yellow? <laughs> Right, well, I think we've bled out. Ooh. Steve, we're dead anyway, but there's somebody here very sneaky. He's over there. Steve. We bled out! Bled out! Bled out. You what? 60 seconds and then you can bleed out and bleed out. I've been here two minutes. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jesus, we're going to get back out of here. We're out, we're out, we're out. We're out. Uh, blue, is that Blue's respawn now? That's blue. Right. Go that way, it's easier. It's easier that way, Steve. <sighs> Dead man walking. Jesus. Right. The enemy. Two down. Nice. Yeah, okay, okay. You're all right, I'm not going to shoot you. You're all right. Flags there. But I know last time there was a guy hiding down here. Did I? Sorry. Yeah, 
Are you looking for the easiest way to get up? This way. It's thick mud, thick as fuck here. You're best off going that way. This is tricky. The flag's there, and I know there's going to be an enemy in that water over there. And this mud is really thick. Whoa! No hit. Where the fuck were they? Hey! In the knackers! So that was actually a really good firefight. Um, took three, three guys out from the ridge up there and decided to try and make way down there and I got shot in the knackers, which is twice today. And with a packet as big as mine, <laughs> it's quite painful. And as you can see, I've got a shimag on and it's actually helping, not now I'm stood still, but it's actually helping stopping the goggles steaming up. So it is probably a viable option. I can hear some guys behind me, it's a good chrono. So, yeah, good day today. Um, this current game, we've got to hold three objectives and hold the flag up, as I've mentioned. And there's only seems to be me and Steve, wherever Steve is, somewhere in the wilderness, on this side of the ridge. So a few kills, but very difficult to take the flag, which is just down there, on your own. Not the easiest thing at all. And I'll show you. This is where we are at the minute. All we've got to do is just get there and hold that flag up to get it. And if we get all three, it's worth 50 points. And I got shot somewhere down there in those trees. I can not even see the enemy. And if I come around here, that guy's chronoing. And there was, just over there, where they've gone to, there was two sneaky yellows, which were the two that I shot earlier. So, really enjoying the water today few issues with batteries and that's a learning lesson but after I've been here over two minutes now so unfortunately I've bled out and if I go to the wrong spawn point I have to sit there for 10 minutes which is I still don't think this 20 minute respawn thing is a good idea so much easier if you know like early morning this is re this respawn vice versa but anyway that's the way it is and I've just bled out dead man walking dead man walking <laughs>